Alishan Mo here on the outskirts of Guan Guangzhou. There is this just massive open space here to fly long range FPV. We are here today with uh, Charles from MFD, my fly dream. Some more <laughs> PV pilots here. We have got David, the best long range pilot here. Hello, David. And today we are going to fly all of these MTDs. So my fly dreams, my twin dreams, long range FPV planes. And uh, here, this is my plane. It has no camera on it. I'm gonna install my GoPro on it. And we're gonna do the maiden of this plane today. We also plan to do some formation flight using the feature of my flight dream autopilot, which actually shows the other pilots and their planes on the OSD screen so you can follow them. Let's set everything up. What's up? Set everything up and get to the flying. All the antenna trackers. One, two, three, four, five, six. So David here already is. <laughs> Hope we can see it. It's difficult to see. He's already 13.3 something kilometer away and is still going. David here is on his milestone today. 19.3 kilometers. He's gonna go 20 kilometers today before he returns home. That's his target. I wish we could see what we are seeing on the screen. <laughs> But my camera is unable to read because of all the reflections. 19.7 and 20 kilometers. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> all right. Hit, hit RTH and go drink some coffee. <laughs> Hit RTH and go drink some coffee. Now David is just going to put his radio down <laughs> and wait for the plane to come back. <laughs> we have more planes to go in the air. Mine and Charles' plane is sitting there. We're just waiting for other people to land so we can fly. Still 10 more kilometers to go and David is just sitting and enjoying. <laughs> his radio is down here. <laughs> <laughs> he's not worried about his plan. Look the way he's sitting here. He needs some coffee here. <laughs> well, now it's the, the feature of the auto antenna tracker from MFD that Charles is going to demonstrate. And that is to track the other plane to fly together. That is, follow each other or formation flying. So they have four antenna trackers connected with a cable together so all the antenna tracker the, the tracking information coming from the planes will be superimposed on the OSD I'm not sure if you can see the OSD here but one person can always see one plane their speed and altitude so they can actually fly so we have one plane there two three right over there Launch. The other icon that you see on the screen, which is jumping around, a little arrow, that's the position of the other plane. Okay, number one and number two. Number one and number two are in the air. You can see he's in front of me, higher than me, 64 meters. Yeah, and right our there. Our distance is 205 meters distance between us. Yeah, I show him. 
So you just see one plane at a time. Yes. Now you need to follow the other plane and get it in the view. Yeah. There, there, see? the other plane in the view. It, it, sorry, <laughs> is this him? I think so. No, no, he's on my right side. He's on your right side. It's somebody else. It's it's Mark, I think. Who's this? It could be Mark. Who's heading to the tower? I'm heading to the tower. It's oh, Mark. Oh, yeah. I see you. Keep. Take hand, Okay, here I come. 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 Six meters away. Come here, come here. 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 Nine. You're flying dangerously close. Five meter away. We don't call this dangerous. We call this dangerous. No, don't touch that plane. We need this footage, buddy. Daddy, daddy. Where's the fourth? All right. Fourth plane is just behind them. <laughs> Beautiful. Charles, Charles is flying really dangerous. So after they are done with the flights, they just put the radio down by activating the RTH. Everybody, yeah, they just turn off the transmitter and just <laughs> wait for the planes to come back, then take over and land. So with the MFD autopilot, I think FPV pilots, they all fly with true confidence. <coughs> so Charles' plane is back and it's starting to circle very, very, right here. <laughs> Now Charles has to turn his radio on and land. Successfully returned to home, maintaining itself safe at its altitude. Yeah, after passing through some crazy turbulence. Yeah, after passing through some crazy flights, not only turbulence. All the planes are back safely. Now all pilots need to do is take control and land so far it has been one great FPV flying day with lots of achievements stay tuned and we will be posting more videos of these amazing planes and a lot of more FPV flights